All right, uh, here's the video review for the Transformers Marvel Crossovers uh, two-pack Iron Man Spider-Man combiner. Picked them up at Target today for 30 bucks instead of the Toys R Us price of 38. I don't know why Toys R Us charges almost ten, a whole another 10 bucks for them. Well worth the week or two wait from the from the release. Um, very, very cool. Um, he is a helicopter, well, Spider-Man is, uh, Iron Man is a jet sort of looking thing. I have no idea what type of jet it's supposed to be, if it's even based on a real jet. Um, they do combine, which I should have a video up, I have a video up for the combination. So, just, uh, here's the link for it. I'll have it in the sidebar and have it up a link probably in the corner of this video somewhere. Probably here, here, here or here, or in the middle, I have no idea, I'm <laughs> one of them, but, uh, very cool, you can see the Spider-Man symbol right there, uh, so, to the transformations, let's start with Iron Man, because he doesn't transform at all in any of the combinations, what you want to do first is take the, the cockpit tip, and fold it up, and it snaps in place, so, to reveal that, when I just take that down, you can see his face, peg it into place. Um. Hmm. Never got that. There we go, okay. There we go, just had, to have, just had to have that chest piece peg in. Now you want to turn these down and around. Uh, Use some force to get his feet to turn like that. Fold the feet in. Like that. And fold that in. And you want to take these. Just kind of fold them down off to the side. And you want to fold his hands out and down. Fold that out. I like to, f I like to have it like that. I have no idea what the official robot mode is because I threw away the box. Um, <clears throat> same thing here. Then, and turn the hand around. Then, I, what I like, this is my personal preference. Fold that back. And flat. Fold that back. I have no, like, again, I have no idea what the instructions, or not the instructions, but what the official mode is. No idea. Don't comment about it, please. This is just my personal preference. <clears throat> so here is the Iron Man figure. Very nice. Um, see a very nice Iron Man-like head sculpt. Um, with not a very Iron Man-like body. It's very bulky, kind of, but yet it's not. I mean, it's just kind of hefty, if you want to say, if I may say. A little hefty to me. I don't know. It does stand quite well. You know, except if you did that, then it would fall over. <laughs> but normally it will stand at a decent rate. Uh, so let's set, I, oh, our articulation wise, the uh, arms can go 360 degrees but are kind of hindered by the back piece. Uh, elbow can go 360 degrees, it can go up, up and go up, you know, for the, for his hand attacks. Head can go 360 degrees, waist can go 360 degrees, legs can go forward and back, side to side, bend at the knee just a little bit. And feet can go up and down. Uh, so that's Iron Man. Now on to Spider-Man. What you want to do is just fold these in like that. Fold that down. And take this piece and fold it back. And, oh, actually what you want to do is you want to circle around here and have these fold up front. My bad. That was a mistake on my part. 
and then you come around here and if you can get a hold of it <laughs> pull out the head there you go. and split the hands split the feet turn this bit around be careful it's on a ball joint it'll pop off quite easily hold it down oh and you want to come in here and grab the feet fold them out and out uh, out and down like that there we go and then you want to come around here and fold this around and pull it out fold in the landing gear if you already haven't turn around the hand then turn this around do the same thing with this arm and turn the hand around if you already haven't done that and this is basic the back piece bit is basically a bit of opportunity of uh, your own little opinion but I actually like to have it down because then it's more of a cape sort of thing kind of has a little hero, hero cape and it folds in quite well. Um, Spider-Man would I have to I'd have to say would be the better of the two pack, um, but they're both pretty nice and their combination is so weak. Um, articulation wise on Spider-Man, his head can go 360, arms can go 360. His he doesn't have any waist articulation. Hand uh, legs can go forward and back, side to side. Bend at the knee. Uh, he does have these bits for combination, but not, no serves no purpose except for knee pads in robot mode. Um, arms can go side to side, forward and back. Um, they cannot rotate. But, um, and the hands can go 360 degrees. So, very nice set. Hold on, let me just set Spider-Man back here. Um, bring in... Iron Man to the shot and not have him fall over. There we go. So basically, uh, but very nice two pack. Um, I suggest if you don't have a Target in the area, which really who doesn't um, that lives in the United States, uh, pick it up at Target instead of like Toys R Us because at Toys R Us it's 38 bucks and it's 30 everywhere else. Well, not Walmart because I haven't seen it there yet. I'm not sure. But at Target it's 30 and Toys R Us it's 38. So, my personal preference, if you want to buy for 38 go ahead and go buy it for extra price at Toys R Us. But if you want to get it for a good price, go to um, Target. Get it for 30 bucks. It probably should be at almost every Target in America by now. If they've done their aisle reset, if they've done their aisle reset, it'll be out there. Trust me. Um, because they don't have any space for it until they move around for the aisle reset. So... This has been the video review for the Iron Man, Spider-Man, Combiner, 2-Pack, uh, Jet, Helicopter thingy. Also, one other thing I forgot to mention, uh, one other thing I need to mention. Uh, here's a size comparison with um, Wolverine. You can see Spider-Man pretty, is pretty big compared to him. Oh, it took Wolverine out of the shot on accident. And uh, Iron Man is, I don't know, let me see, just a tad bit taller. I mean, but this... This big, bigger compared to Wolverine, just not just a tad. So there's a size comparison.